So I'm out here on a service call for this Resner unit heater. Um, the biggest complaint was the thing was making a bunch of noise with the fan. The fan blade was making a bunch of noise when it was running. Um, the guy told me that he had kind of bent the blades um, because I think what was happening is it's kind of hard to see, but they're hitting the, the metal housing here. It looks like the, the fan blade itself has slid down the shaft a little bit. You can kind of vaguely see it there on the shaft. Um, let's see, like right at the bottom right there, that kind of black mark. Right in that area, you could tell it looks like it slid probably, a, I don't know, half an inch or something like that. Um, this set screw on this thing is in a pain in the ass spot. We have to take like this whole thing apart just to get to it. Um, but I can see that this thing's been hitting for a while. I'm in a warehouse that usually doesn't have anyone in it. Um, so I think it's been hitting for a while with him bending everything and stuff too. Um, I mean, to get you through a temporary bind, you could take everything apart and slide it out some. Um, but I think for the long-term fix, I'd like to see um, a new blade put on this thing because with it hitting, I just don't want to see um, like long-term effect from this thing just getting out of balance and starting to shake and do all those things, which I'm sure other guys have seen. Uh, so I think that the, the right way to do it is putting a new blade on. It looks like at some point the motor here was replaced probably in the not too distant future and it doesn't look like the blade was done at the same time. Um, but yeah, so I'm gonna write it up for putting in a new blade. Uh, I'll probably take it apart and at least get a temporary fix so they have heat running right now, but um, I'm gonna recommend a new blade. Whether they wanna do it or not is up to them, but I do have seen a lot of stuff get out of balance and just take out a lot more, make the, the situation much worse. So um, that's kind of what I'm seeing here. Um, pretty simple, straightforward deal. It was pretty easy to see. Um, I mean, the guy who showed me kind of told me most of what was going on. So that's just my, what I want to do to take care of this particular issue. But uh, I, I checked the heat exchangers too, because the Resner is pretty dang old, but I didn't see any cracks or anything like that. So um, that's pretty much everything on this one. It's pretty straightforward, easy. Um, if you liked the video, give it a thumbs up. If you haven't already, please subscribe. And thank you guys for watching.